She is dead. She is fucking dead. Wait, is she like actually dead or? Yeah, I think that means she's actually fucking dead. Let's see. No, I do not want to do that. Let's see, WASD to move. I need to get dressed. Okay. I made a little bad night, didn't I? Okay. Now we wait for the call. The call. What call? My therapist has not called yet. Grab drugs. I'd rather smoke. This pain calms me down. Let's see. How about I get a little TV action? Rather not now. Oh. Wait. Is that my therapist? Yep. Yes, Dr. Calkins. I am on my way. Okay. This is my front door right here. Locked. Okay. There we go. Dr. Calkins is in room 16. Oh. Hi. God, that was freaky. Uh, 4, 14, uh, 5, 15, 16. Okay. Thanks a lot for visiting me in, in the hotel. I understand this might be, this might not be your usual practice, but I really needed to talk. I am glad you decided to do this again. Considering your position and tragic circumstances, I was more than willing to help. Dr. Calkins, uh, can you tell me, once again, what, what did you decide to move from your apartment and pay a great deal of money for this hotel? After what happened to my sister, I was unable to stay there every night. I had the same nightmare about her and it was a torture for me. I was lucky enough to get some money from my employer, at least for now. I do not have to worry about paying the rent and I can enjoy a hotel pizza. Kate, this is not healthy. You have to face the issue right up front. You cannot live in this hotel forever. You talked about the nightmares. Can you describe them for me? They are very real at times, but usually when I wake up, the nightmares does not end. I have this deep feeling more like a voice telling me to do something. What does that voice tell you to do exactly, Kate? Is it very important to say it out loud to ensure that it is not real? The voice tells me to kill someone. To kill? Who? Does the voice specify a person? A name? Is it somehow connected to your sister's suicide? Kate, I need you to focus on this. I don't know. It just tells me to kill. I see my sister, and she is so real, but there is something off about her. Something sinister in her voice. Kate, does your sister tell you to kill someone? Do you see her? Do you see your sister in this room right now? Yes, I do. Kate, Kate, Kate. I am sorry. I, I am sorry. My head hurts. The medication is not helping at all. And I don't know what to do. I fucking don't know how to get her out of my head. Kate, I need you to stay alert at all times. I will prescribe something for the headache. We will meet again in three days. All right. If there is an emergency, please call me. Alright, alright. I will try to do the med meditation technique you told me about. Thanks again for the talk. It means more to me than you can imagine. Looking forward to the next visit. Jesus. Huh. I should go to my room. Oh god, it's so weird. What was my room number again? Okay. 
the numbers over here. What is this on the table? Dear Miss Anderson, we hope this letter finds you well. I want to extend our appreciation for choosing Velza Vista Hotel. For your recent stay, unfortunately, it has come to our attention that we are some issues that require immediate attention. We have received multiple complaints from other guests or our staff regarding loud banging noises and an unpleasant odor um, originating from your room. To ensure the comfort and tranquility of our guests, we kindly request that you please adhere the, to the hotel's noise policy and be mindful of your noise level. If there is a specific issue or concern that requires our attention, please do not hesitate to contact our front desk. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation in this matter. We look forward to the remainder of your stay at our hotel. Sincerely, Vova Vista Hotel Manager. Okay. Put some clothes in the closet. Locked. Oh, that's my closet. I am so tired. I should lay down. Yeah. Who is knocking? Can't they leave me alone? <laughs> Who is knocking? Excuse me. Hello? What the fuck? I should close that. Oh my god! Ah, ah, ah. Oh, fuck the lights. I should get my phone. What in the... Locked. Locked. Oh, my... Locked. Oh, God. Okay. Why the fuck did I even come here? This hospital is rotten. I wish my sister was here. But as usual, she has too many fucking problems to deal with. Unlike me, a drug addict who is trying to break free from all this. Okay. What? What is this Silent Hills PT bullcrap? What? Locked? Oh. Every day is the same loop. I go to this hospital. I get some medication, try to be a better self, yeah. But what is the point? My sister doesn't give a shit. Anyway, I might die tomorrow and she won't even remember. That's pretty bad. God, if I ever see that weird white figure again, I'm going to explode. Oh. My medical history is pretty short. Nothing of value in broken things, but maybe if my sister is interested, maybe if she can pick up the phone... And at least once be curious. All I can do is hope for the best. Bullshit praise. What? Um. Nothing here. I should search the rest. Uh, demography details. This year old patient presents for alcohol and cannabis withdrawal. History was obtained from the patient. Uh, chief complaint. I want rehab. I have been using. Uh, general history. Circumstances of admission. Patient is a single year old uh, AA woman. 
um, with bipolar disorder, alcohol and cannabis abuse, other dependents who has admitted in the, with the system systems of, of symptoms of depression, including, uh, CAH of voices telling her to her herself. She has done outpatient program and wants to change her life this time. Referral papers reviewed. Discharge summary. Discharge instructions. Uh, physical exam reviewed. Nothing here. I should search the rest. There's nothing else. <gasps> uh, sis? Will kill you to put on some pants? Okay, shit, the battery died. Now what? Do you feel it now? Do you feel guilty? You selfish B-I-T-C-H. You abandoned me when I needed you. You made a promise. You said you were always going to be with me. Go back. Go back and end this. Oh, I should check on my sister first. What? Huh? What? Oh, game by. Oh God. Okay. Okay. Cool. <laughs> oh wow. Thank you for playing. God, that was so freaky. What the hell's going on? Oh, am I in prison? Read. Take your cell key. Come and find me. How did you get out? This place is a nightmare. Can you help me, too? There might be more keys in the warden's office. Okay, warden's office. Um, yeah, library, warden. Showers. Okay, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be finding here. But I just know I'm in a prison. I gotta get into the warden's office somehow. <gasps> oh my god, what? Uh, oh great, I need a combination. To get out of here, so... Okay, warden's office it is. Oh, there we go. Okay. You picked up the key. For cell number one. Alright, cell number one. I have no idea of, like... Okay, here's... Did I told you to save someone? The code is 666. Look at what you made me do. What? Code is 666. Okay. Okay, cool. 
I get out of here alive by myself, as usual. Kind of. Kind of usual. Went to the code 666. Something tells me that I... Okay, you got... You got now a flashlight. Press F to toggle the, the light. Zero, one, and four. Are you kidding me? You have got to be joking. Oh, uh, what? Hi. Oh. Oh. Uh. Wait, wait a minute. Whoa. Wrong way. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, I met. I'm going around you creepy assholes. Come on, come on, out the door. Out the door. Finally free. What? Am I finally free? What? Oh, come on, what was that point? Oh! What? Oh, that's pretty. You will never leave this for second place. Sure is cold tonight. Although it is nice to get out of the subway even every now and then. Gets tiring sitting all day asking strangers for change. Three euros and four E is all I got today. Not much, but it should keep me going for now. Let's try to get some sleep soon. What the? Another shooting? The city gets out. Uh, it's getting out of hand. Well, I should probably have a look. Okay, so I can decide to walk any faster if I wanted to. Shooting victim. No, no, no. This ain't good. You, listen. You got to take this. Please. Don't let it take the case. Be careful, it might take form someone else. I'm sorry. It's here. Oh! Do you see it? Only we can see it now. We need to get out of here. There's a subway down the alley. Get the last train now. Okay. Okay, cool. Okay. Subway. Let's get to the subway. Luckily, I was able to get, get the last train. I'll get off on the last stop and find somewhere to rest up for the night. What's so important about this case? I've already tried to open it, but it won't budge. I'll try to force it open while I get the... Wait. Where the... Where did I put my ticket? Must have dropped it when I was running away from that creep. I'm gonna need to get. A, I'm gonna need another to get through the exit. Although I'm a bit short of funds right now. If all 
followed me. Oh! How can I, how can no one else see it? Doesn't matter, I gotta get out of the station. Shit, there is. Okay, good. It can follow me. Okay, good. Come on. Come on. Come on, let me through. Okay, so, so far I know I could disguise as anyone else. Oh my god, he's getting closer. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, come on! Ah. Man, I had to stop and sneeze, didn't I? Okay, maybe if I'm smart this time. This time I'm a little smart about this. Why does this thing want this suitcase so badly? Sense. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay, homeless man on the action. 
Everybody get out of the way. Okay. Come on. Nice, real nice. Let's get out of here. Oh, yeah. Thanks for playing. <laughs> okay, cool. That was really, uh, that was really strategizing. 